recorders from Michael Pretorius's Syntagma Musicum, great bass in F at the left, quint bass in B flat, bass, etc. The great bass recorder is a member of the recorder family. With the revival of the recorder by Arnold Dolmetsch, who chose Baroque music and the corresponding recorder types as a fixed point, consideration was given to the design of recorder types larger than the bass recorder. The great bass recorder has up to seven keys, which serve to facilitate access to the finger holes. For modern large bass recorders woods like maple or African babinga are used. The term usually applies to an instrument with ranges CD2, but has also been used to describe an instrument descending to B flat or else to the low bass recorder in F, alternatively known as a contrabass. When great bass is used for the instrument in low F, the instruments in C and B flat are referred to as quart bass and quint bass, respectively, because they are a fourth and fifth below the ordinary small bass, or basset. The prefixes great and contra refer to the registers from C to B and from C to B, respectively, in Helmholtz pitch notation. In the Germanisches Nationalmuseum in Nuremberg are two famous great bass recorders. Both are of the Renaissance type, despite the fact that the instrument of Hieronymus F. Kinsker is provided on the headpiece with high Baroque ornaments. This recorder is part of an ensemble set that is made of plum wood. For larger recorders pair wood is usually used, for reasons of cost. The great bass recorder requires a key for the bottom note, which was protected by a so-called fontanelle. An S-shaped vocal or crook is used to make it somewhat more comfortable to play the instrument. Because the finger holes are not covered with keys, some of the tone holes are placed in acoustically unfavorable locations to accommodate the hand. The relatively large finger span distance reduces fluency of playing. As an authentic instrument, the great bass recorder has a short history of about 100 to 120 years. The instrument is only described in the Syntagma Musicum of Michael Pretorius and Marin Mersenne. The earliest great bass recorder is probably that in the collection of Venetian Catajo Palace. It is now in the Kunsthistorisches Museum in Vienna. The great bass recorder is given the name bass flat by Michael Pretorius, and described by him as an instrument in B-flat, a perfect fifth lower than the basset. Or small bass in F. Marin Mersenne describes a great bass recorder with a very delicate carved double key for the lowest tone and the overlying semitone. The problem of the minor second above the bass tone, which can be achieved only by half holing and which not every recorder player can get used to, is not solved by Mersenne's innovation by analogy to other instruments. The Kinsker instrument from the Germanisches National Museum is both a high point and the end point of development. It lags behind Mersenne's ideas. It is possible that it was already conceived as historicizing. Thanks for watching.